Hey YouTube, it's Natalie again. Um, in this video I just kind of want to talk about uh, gender affirmation and uh, my voice and stuff like that. As you'll notice I moved to a new, new location and finally have some decent lighting. Although the audio is probably still going to suck. Um, so yeah, gender affirmation. Um, being at a Christian university and all that jazz, I am living with males. Um, it's rather difficult because of the fact that um, if I had my choice, I would live with females. Not that I don't love my roommates, I think that they're really awesome guys, I just would much prefer to live with females. Um, I also you know, want female friends who are both really accepting and wish to do things with me. Uh, wish to do things that are somewhat more stereotypically female, the things that I do like, that I'm not just conforming to the stereotype to be a transsexual woman. Um, but I don't really have many of those friends. Like, I actually really don't have any. I I should say as a disclaimer that I I don't hate my friends. I don't hate my family. I'm not upset that they're not a hundred percent accepting or not accepting at all or whatever. that's a decision they have to make themselves but it's still really difficult um, not having any or, any or very little affirmation as a female from a female support um, I do have a um, couple of um, heterosexual female friends now um, who are very accepting and affirming um, but transportation is an issue so we don't get to really go out and do a lot of things that would help affirm my gender such as just you know shoe shopping and all that jazz and other ridiculously girly things and so on and so forth um, and that's very difficult. I think it's very important as a transsexual to uh, affirm your gender whatever way you can and to have people who affirm your gender. And even in the simple things like pronouns, it's very, very difficult to hear the name Michael now, um, which is my born name. Um, as well as to be referred to as he, it's rather painful, um, and I really strongly prefer uh, she. It, it is who I am. I am female. Um, and so yeah, um, I am very lucky in the fact that I'm blessed with a slightly more feminine form. I don't have any hips to speak of, <laughs> but I'm have a pretty small frame, um, not very tall, um, slightly more feminine face, but unfortunately my voice just isn't <laughs> passable at all. So sometimes I will get referred to as um, ma'am or you pass as a girl until I open my trap and then I'm screwed <laughs> and uh, this usually results in the person taking <laughs> uh, backstepping a little and being very confused um, uh, of course since I live in Minnesota very very apologetic because oh no they offended me when actually they didn't because I am female that's how I would like to be referred to but it's you can't just have a 
three hour long conversation with someone, you know, about how you're a transsexual woman every single time that thing, that incident occurs. So there's that, so I really need to start working out on my female voice, but I guess I really have difficulty understanding all the voice videos that I've been looking at and what exactly I'm supposed to do and how to shift the falsetto and all that jazz. So, yeah, that's pretty much all I want to talk about. So, if you like my videos, you know, please comment, please message me if you have any questions, like that, any suggestions. Um, if you would like me to do a video about something, please leave me that. Um, and yeah, tell your friends watch this video. Um, also, if you would like to donate to my transition, uh, I will list my uh, PayPal email and Skyrim account below. Thank you. Bye.